Almost 30 percent of Taiwan's 4.1 million recovered COVID patients experienced at least one long COVID symptom. Some patients even say that the symptoms could eventually cost them their jobs. Many have sought alternative treatment for relief, but traditional Chinese medicine practitioners warn patients not to self-medicate. After recovering from COVID, this university lecturer says she often feels out of breath giving lectures. She says her voice now goes hoarse very easily, and she has to stop for a sip of water every so often. She wonders if her day's teaching are numbered. My voice would become hoarse two or three minutes into the class. I couldn't carry on at all after that. So I would have to take a sip of warm water discreetly. The psychological toll mainly stems from worrying that my hoarseness could affect my job in the future. Long COVID symptoms include coughs, sore throat and in severe cases, shortness of breath. And not just when climbing up the stairs. Even when walking on flat ground, you'd feel out of breath very quickly. Difficulty sleeping or waking up mid-sleep. Skin rashes and itchiness not induced by the warm weather. The skin might itch even in an air-conditioned room, and flare-ups are unpredictable. The practitioner says that 5 in 10 COVID patients seeking traditional Chinese treatment experience long COVID symptoms. Of them, 28 percent experience fatigue, 19 percent have brain fog, and 18 percent feel shortness of breath, chest pains, and tightness. In traditional Chinese medicine, brain fog can be treated with Chinese herbal medicine or acupuncture. Once patients are released from quarantine, they can seek treatment and get acupuncture. The traditional Chinese medicine practitioner says that patients with long COVID seeking alternative therapies should avoid self-medication and seek treatment from licensed practitioners.